Get it? I put my money where my mouth is. See? You, this will only make sense if you've watched the previous video. I'll link that up here. It's where I compare the iPads available from Apple and I pick one and then I go ahead and buy it and do an unboxing thing. That's today. I bought the damn thing and I'm waiting for it to... I think that might be it. Because you can't have an unboxing video with the tool that every unboxer needs. A knife. This is just a standard kitchen knife, not one of those fancy hipster knives that you see some of the bigger channels use. But that's fine because it's got serrated edges and it's good to work. So you know it's gotten to the point where Amazon packages are fun to expect now because it's always something fun that you have wanted because you've ordered it for yourself. Alright, here we go. Free shipping it says. Ooh, I love the smell of free shipping. Free shipping. Maybe go down the middle? Yeah, go down the middle. You can tell I haven't done this before on camera. You don't think about these things when you're off camera. Right? It's a little ASMR action. What's in the box? Whoa! Ta-da! That's right. We've got an iPad. And we got one of these babies. This is cool. Expensive. But cool. Alright, let's start off with the main event, shall we? So that's the iPad Air. Fourth generation with Wi-Fi only. I didn't get the one with the SIM card. I didn't see the point. 256 gigs though. And the good thing about this iPad Air is that it's got a USB-C charging cable, which means I can buy other charging cables and use them. I'm not dependent on Apple's lightning cable, which is... How do you, how do, you do this? How do people do this so smoothly? Damn it. Do I have to... Oh no, it is coming off. It's, just, is this what people do? They just keep doing this until it slides off the bottom? Or is it's the way of the YouTuber, folks? The, oh my god. It's, it's a little bit of a workout. Remember those shake weights they used to get 10 years ago where you just shake, 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 and you're supposed to lose the weight? Yeah, just keep doing unboxing videos. You'll lose weight. Ta da! Nice little plastic tab over there to raise the device beautifully out. We'll just keep that aside. Alright, you've got the usual Apple stuff in. Designed by Apple in California A. Standard Apple stickers. Alright, never gonna put that up anywhere. He's got a little booklet on how to start off. Who cares? We just jump right in. Comes with a charger, unlike certain other devices. Wait, is that the wrong charger for the wrong? That's okay, we have a converter, so that's fine. USB C charging cable, obviously, and anything else in here? Nope, that's it. Fingerprints, no, can't get the fingerprints. Damn it, how do I do this without fingerprints? Okay, there we go. That's admittedly not the best peel in the world, but you know what? Fingerprints are gonna happen anyway, so there you have it, folks. Does it have power? Yes, yes, it does. Okay. Now, while it's doing that, let's talk about the device itself. See, one thing they've done is they've gone with the flat sides, like the old iPads used to just sort of come up to a point, it used to just thin out and taper out to the edges. But the new ones, they've gone for flatter sides and I can see there's a little patch over there. That's actually the magnetic patch to which this pencil should snap pretty seamlessly so you can have your pencil and your pad going around. It's your little notepad. It works really well. I like it. I like it a lot. I like the thin bezels. There's a very small front-facing camera and at the back you've got that singular camera with a tiny little something. Now it's not a flash, no, that's a microphone. So you've got a small microphone at the back. This thing has two speaker grills over here and it's got two more speaker grills on the other side. But this has two speakers only. If you want four speakers, you've got to upgrade to the iPad Pro. Personally, I think stereo speakers are going to be fine. We'll try it out in a minute. It's got these three dots at the base. It's a connector. It's a smart connector and they've got accessories that go with it. The idea is, of course, you don't connect it via the USB. So you've got the USB-C port free. And one of the interesting things is they've done away with the home button in the new versions of the iPad. Some people like having a physical button, but personally, I've been using Jesse for a long time now. Gestures work really well. You don't need that button there and you can have thinner bezels. I'm a fan of that. Quick start. Bring your current iPhone or iPad near this iPad to sign in and set up. Bring it close by. Okay. Hello. Oh, I can actually feel the magnet here. 
Oh, okay. So you get this cool little misty matrixy thing going on, very uh, very ethereal. And then apparently you've got to hold it up and line it up with that circle over there. There we go. It's lined up. Ah, and it worked. Keep this iPhone near your iPad while your information is transferred. Alright. While that's happening, we may as well open our other thing. This is the Apple Pencil in conjunction with this particular iPad Air. It was a little more cost effective to get this and you get that functionality of having the Apple Pencil as well. So you got the pencil for iPad models with magnetic pencil connector. That's this one. Perfect. We got the right one. That's a good thing. Oh my God, they have a manual for the pencil. Okay, that's the manual. <laughs> That's the manual for the pencil, there's not much to do. Press the button, put it on the side, and you can replace the tip. I didn't know that. Look at that, that's pretty cool. It's cool because what they've done with this pencil is they've put one flat side, it's not all round because it used to just roll away all the time. Now, see? Okay, it's got that plastic tab on, we'll take that off. That was with force, but if I just leave... Okay, apparently it keeps rolling and it didn't even stop on the flat side, it just stopped on its own. So... I mean, it kind of stopped. It does slow it down a little. It gives it a little bit of resistance every time it goes over the flat side and that's a good thing. But I did expect it to just stop. But it is very nice looking. The feel, it's got this sort of matte finish, beautiful soft matte finish. It's got that little tip that you can apparently change and replace. So if the tip ever gets worn out, you can replace it. And maybe you can even get like a sharper, finer tip. I don't know if that's possible. I don't know if Apple even has anything like that. And you've got this little nice little pencil written right there. Now we'll try and get the pencil to work next. I just slap the pencil on the side there and uh, welcome to the Apple Pencil. Check it out. So there you have it. It's the iPad Air with the Apple Pencil and as you can see when I when I slap it onto the side over here it automatically starts charging up 62%. That's actually really really cool. That's uh, yeah that's been it. Thanks for tuning in. That's been my first unboxing video. I don't know if I uh, needed to add anything more but uh, We'll see you in the next one. Stay happy, stay peaceful, stay colorful.